Latian Sospai. Uh, I come from, from Mala. Uh, I graduated like plant science in Oro Agricultural Polytechnic College. And I was internship before uh, one and a half years ago with a cultivate. Now I'm continuing as manager of a greenhouse. Uh, first of all, we, I, I will explain about the structure of a greenhouse. This greenhouse, we use different materials to install, like mesh shedding net, polyethylene plastic, and the method is, and the fourth one is mesh 50 mesh net. And they have their own advantages. The, uh, the above that we look, the black one is uh, uh, 50 shedding net. It uh, produces 50% uh, shedding and 50% it uh, controls the sunlight to reflect above. And uh, the second one is polyethylene plastic. This is 150 polyethylene plastics. And it have different advantages, uh, UV, infrared, and uh, light diffusion. It uh, spreads in equal amount or they got, the ceiling here, they got equal amount uh, sun, uh, sunlight. Um, and this, uh, the third one is 50 mesh. 50 mesh means 50 holes per, per inch or a per centimeter. Uh, this greenhouse, it has 660 meter square area and it produces uh, 300,006 seedlings per cycle. So from this uh, this advantage, we can produce in small area uh, more seedlings. It is easy to manage this greenhouse, one or two percent only here. But if we uh, take this seedlings, this amount of seedlings outside, it's difficult to manage uh, outside. Uh, we use alcohol. The advantage of alcohol is to reduce like contamination, bacterial disease, or uh, it kills. After that, we'll, uh, we, ha we are using industrial growing media here in the greenhouse. They have their own advantages, like pit moss uh, and vermiculite. We are using pit moss and vermiculite. Uh, pit moss, it have water holding capacity. And this is a vermiculite and it have like high aeration and we use the combination of two uh, growing medium. If it is like this one, it will be it will be enough. When I, I like I compact it like I squeeze and like this, if it's going water, it is like too wet, and it's enough. That's it. Now I will put on the tray. We have two types of tray, like one uh, 17 cc and 30 cc. This one we use for the small. Uh, vegetables like lettuce, cabbage, uh, and this one we use uh, like tomato, uh, eggplant, co uh, cucumber. Now I will sow cabbage and I will use this one. After that I will fill the tray. one uh, seed per hole. Now I will put uh, under incubation. The advantage of incubation is to uh, have a uniform germination for the plants and the incubation the place it should be humid, uh, dark and uh, 
hot. I put this one uh, uh, under incubation. Different plants, they need different uh, time of incubation. Like this one, I put it in uh, cabbage and I will check after 24 hours. After we uh, check the, in the incubation place, if they, they are germinate, they start to germinate and we, we spread it to, on the table. This is the hydraulic pump we use for the fertigation. After we saw the real leaf plants, they need a fertilizer to make uh, like support to make photosynthesis. And we mix the fertilizer here inside. It will suck the uh, mixture of water and the fertilizer is going by this one. After that, we'll give the fertilizer by manually uh, on the plants or seedlings. The, we have two types of uh, materials for the monitoring. We have this one, the blue trap, st uh, stick trap and the uh, yellow the stick trap. Oh, yeah,